In this video, we want to show you how easy it is to send a sample with the Timbo 600 Vita. In front of the Vita, you have the mouth where you insert the sample. You have a circle who can become steady green, flashing green. And if you had an error, it will come up with a red cross here. When you want to send a sample, it's very important that you grab it by the cap end and inserted it like this. You can see it flash, it means it's working, and now it's steady, it's ready again. It's also important that you don't insert the samples too fast, then you will have an error again. Just remove the sample and the Vita is ready again. If you have an error, you will go to the side of the Vita. There is a service hatch. Behind the service hatch, there is a uh, display where you can see what kind of error you have. You have the main switch for the power supply. And of course, you just press this button if you need to take the power of the unit. Go to the manual and see how to solve this error. There are also some videos who can show how to solve these errors.